So Royston on the Easter weekend, three goals in, in the first 30 minutes and Daryl Wheeler injury. Do you know how he's doing? Um, yeah, he's he's improving slightly. Um, he was told three to five weeks, which would kind of count him out for the season. Um, he is a quick healer, but we'll, ju we'll just have to see because it's very difficult with an ankle. You can't kind of, if it's not right, it's not right, and he won't be able to twist and turn and, and play his normal game. So I think he's still probably a few weeks away, but um, we'll, we'll see how he goes over the, over the next week or two. Uh, Guildford City, the one-off draw on uh, Easter Monday, was that a crucial point for us? Uh, yeah, it was in the end because um, obviously when you're 1-0 down in the 87th minute, you, you'll take a point. Uh, we were disappointed with how the game went, it, it, we didn't play to our potential really, uh, but they, they battled very hard. I think it was probably a, a fair result. Uh, it might turn out to be a really good point gained, um, we, we'll only know at the end of the season, but um, no complaints, it was, it was a fair result. And Met Police, uh, the cup game in the week, with that some extravagant goal from Jamie McLeod, how do you rate that one? It was very good. I mean, we joked on the bench with Darren um, that that was the goal of the season, and obviously he'd scored the great goal on the Saturday. They were both very different goals, but but brilliant goals. So um, very hard to choose between them actually. Yeah, also, Adam putting us uh, two one up into the and into the final. What are the chances of winning? Um, well, we'll see who we've got. Um, we'll be positive, whoever it is. It's, it's nice that we've we've got there, and we can kind of just get on with the league campaign now and, and have that to look forward to. Um, obviously, if it's well, whichever team it will be, it will be a tough game. Um, but it's a one-off game. It will be a great occasion for the club to go there. It will be a great night for all of us. So we're just looking forward to it. And today's game against Aylesbury, a bit of a stop and start game. With the only goal in the 24th second, what did you make of the rest of the game? Not a lot, really. Kind of, We started brilliant and, and went downhill from there. Um, to be honest, a lot of it was tiredness today. The lads put so much into Thursday. Um, and you could see they just had no energy. They were very flat today. And um, it wasn't through lack of trying, but um, it was pretty tough to watch. I think we, we found it hard to watch on the bench. I know the supporters, there was a few shouts and frustrations, which they, they're not used to seeing us play like that. But I think people just need to realise how hard our players work when they play and how hard they've worked in the past week. And they just couldn't play their normal game today. And it was very scrappy. We're just delighted that we held on, held on for the win. Thank you.